What's up guys, it's Natalie Tasha and welcome back to my channel. Today I'm going to be doing a winter favorites video and I am lucky enough to have this video sponsored by Honor, the new Android phone, which I absolutely love and it happens to be the first thing on my winter favorites thing because like why wouldn't it be the only favorite thing that you have for winter because it's perfect. Can we talk about how cool this phone is? One, it's beautiful. The color is my goodness gracious. It's gold, it's rose gold. What more do you need in life? When I got this phone, I literally almost cried because it matches my aesthetic so much. And you probably saw a picture I posted on like Instagram of this phone and everything else that matched because it's perfect. As you know, I love taking selfies. So when you take a selfie on this phone, it has like a beautifying filter. So it like automatically softens your face. So you don't have to put it through another app to soften your face or make your face look beautiful because it just makes your like face look beautiful on its own. And it's perfect. And I love it. And, and that's the reason it's my number one winter favorite. So yeah, that's it. I might just be switching to Team Android because this phone is so perfect. Moving on with my winter favorites, my second winter favorite is my bath ball. I'm absolutely in love with this thing. The color is perfect. It's like this light pinky color. I think it looks white just because of how bright the light is in this room, but it's so cute. I bought it in New York in November and I didn't realize how much use I was gonna get out of it because it was just like attached to my backpack. But then I started driving and it's attached to my keys and it's the cutest thing in the world. And I see everybody else that has like a black and white one, but I'm like, hey, look, I stand out because mine is pink, so hot. Get on my level because I have a pink puff ball and if anybody tells me that puff balls are not necessary, then they can just drop out of my life, okay? Okay. The third thing on my winter favorites is this Smashbox Contour Palette. I got it, I want to say, like two months ago, and I've just been using it for its full potential. It's perfect. It's 100% perfect. It's not in focus right now. It's fine. It's fine. But it has three different colors, so it has, like, the contour, the bronzer, and the highlight, and it's phenomenal. I mean, look at this. So if you guys are trying to get into contouring your face, then I would highly recommend this because it's beautiful. It's 100% beautiful. Moving on with makeup favorites, I have another kind of contour thing that I like to add to my Smashbox contour stuff. So that is the Makeup Forever Pro Sculpting Duo. But basically, this is the contour set. Personally, I don't like the contour part of it. Like the bronzer is too, it's like, uh, it's like too red for me. I don't really like it. It doesn't really go with my skin tone. That's why I use the Smashbox. And the highlight in the Smashbox doesn't have like a shimmery tint to it, which I really personally like. Some people don't like that. So that's why I've been using this highlight from the Makeup Forever Pro Sculpting Duo set. And it's it's beautiful. Like I can't begin to tell you how beautiful this, this set is. I just like want to put it all over my face all the time. Uh, can you have too much highlight? Probably. Do I put too much highlight? Probably. Is it because I love this highlight? 100% yeah. I sometimes don't always want to wash my hair. Maybe it's because I'm lazy. Maybe it's just because I want to sleep. I don't know. You know, I take showers. I'm a cleanly person, but you know, sometimes I just don't want to wash my hair every day. For those days that I really just don't want to wash my hair, I have been using this No Drought Dry Shampoo from Lush. Most perfect thing I've ever come across in my life. I've used like some of the spray ones before, but I don't like the texture it gives my hair because it's like a hairspray texture and it kind of makes my hair like hard and like, I, don't, I, I just don't like it. This is like a powder with a little puff. Some of it comes out and then you can just like puff it into your hair. Ah! I put too much. It's fine, I'll just look like a grandma the rest of the video and it's all over my leggings, life's great. But it goes into your hair so nicely and all you have to do is just like hit your head really hard and pray that you don't get a migraine. But honestly, if you guys are looking for a good dry shampoo, I know I've tried the Bumble and Bumble one. I liked it for a second and then I didn't like the way it made my hair feel. So definitely go with like the No Drought Dry Shampoo from Lush. This thing has lasted me so long. I've been using it since July, over six months and I'm not even halfway through the product yet. So I would highly recommend this if you guys are looking for a good dry shampoo. I have some on my forehead too. Okay, so I know like I'm doing fashion and beauty and lifestyle and whatnot, but I guess like, food is lifestyle. These are my babies and literally my babies, literally my babies. So during VidCon, me and Griffin and Olivia and Mikey and Tati and Justice, we all went to Target. At Target's, Tati bought some bananas. And I was like, oh, these are like really, really good, whatever, you know? And trust me, they were very, very good. But I didn't think much of them for like a couple months until I went to my local grocery store and they sold them. Ever since then, I've eaten one chocolate banana a night. I refuse to look at the calories. I really want to look at the calories right now, but I 100% refuse to look at the calories just because I know if I do, I'm never going to eat them again. But yeah, if you're into chocolate or into bananas, you know, I would highly recommend these. So good. You can buy them at Target. Sprouts, those are the only two places I've seen them. There's probably others. If you know others, comment those down below. But they are called Diane's Banana Babies and they're super good. Since I've been eating so many banana babies, I figured that I should probably start working out and that's where the 
these next favorites come into play. So I'm the type of person that really focuses on a brand, which can be a good thing and a bad thing at the same time. But I never realized how good Forever 21's athletic wear was until I bought some. I bought two sports bras, two pairs of leggings, and a workout bag for $70. That's less expensive than one pair of Lululemon leggings. And these leggings are freaking phenomenal. So phenomenal. And I think there's like dust in the air, so there's dust going everywhere. I think these both were $19.90 each. These ones are like super cute and they're like stretchy and they're super comfortable and they're warm. I wore them in the snow like last weekend and I wasn't cold at all and they say like beat you to it on the side. So they're like super duper cute and I absolutely love these and I think you should buy them because they're perfect. The other pair of leggings I got were these black ones and then they have like marble on the side and like a little green outline. I wasn't a fan of the green outline just because I personally don't like green but they're super comfortable and they're stretchy and the material is so phenomenal. So if you guys are looking for good active wear I would highly suggest Forever 21. I'm also wearing one of their sports bras right now but I'm not about to lift up my shirt and show you my boobs. So there's that. Well that's it for today's video. I really hope you guys enjoyed it. Make sure to give it a big thumbs up if you did and comment down below what your favorite thing for the winter is because I'm curious what your guys' winter favorites are. Also don't forget to subscribe so you guys can see new videos from me every single week and don't forget to follow me on all of my social media platforms, Instagram, Twitter, and Snapchat. Also make sure to give my Facebook a big like if you love me. I will be back with a new video next week and yeah that's it for today. Goodbye, goodbye, goodbye. I love you guys so much. Goodbye. Oh. <gasps>